So today's video is for Monday. We have changed locations to another campground. This one allows uh, generator hours to be till 9 p.m. where the other campground was 7 p.m. And we're having to do laundry, which takes forever. Fortunately, we have a washer and dryer in the RV, but it does require us to run that generator a lot. And so today's day, today's work is just moving over to the other location, uh, reloading with water supplies, and getting all of the laundry done, cleaning the inside of the truck, cleaning the inside of the trailer, which is fine. You know, we did a lot of hiking yesterday, and uh, it's time to let our bodies rest a little bit. In a previous video, I talked about the snow that's on the mountains, and there's just very, very little, as you can see up there. So, for this area, they are expecting another very dry year, and it does go in cycles. If you're worried about global warming, climate change, all of that, these are normal cycles for this area, for Death Valley. Anyway, across the way where you see all the palm trees is the uh, Death Valley Ranch. It's now a resort area, Furnace Creek, and it's not very busy. It really is not busy at all. Everybody is wearing a mask. They're all scared to death. Yeah, you walk in close, even close to one of the stores, and the people there that are working there are like, you've got to have a mask on. And, you know, we make our stand and they go, no, you don't understand. You have to have a mask on or I'm going to get fired. So the people have now been instructed to be the police of the world over the masking. What you see in the distance there is the Death Valley Inn. I think it might be called Inn at the Death Valley. Uh, but it's another big posh resort. Very expensive to stay there. And we were surprised. We, we went over there yesterday to check it out. And the front parking lot was full. But it, overall, there's not a lot of people there. And again, everybody is just so PC about this masking. And when you talk to them on the side... They're like, no, we agree with you 100%. But we need a job. We've got to have our job. So when we begin to start thinking about what they might do in the near future as far as taking guns away, uh, these people are going to react the same way. They're, they're afraid. And if you can't work, you can't eat. So, you know, we saw a video where Bill Gates is saying, you know, there's going to be food shortage shortages in the future. Well, of course there will be. He bought 427,000 acres of our farmlands. And with that, there's going to be food shortages because he's going to stop producing. And he says, for those people that comply, we'll be giving them a ration of protein, protein meals, a meat substitute. Not meat, a meat substitute. Yeah, it's that crazy. It's that ridiculous. And if the people aren't standing up, if the common person that just has the common job, like right over there, if they don't start standing up, it's going to happen worldwide. And that's what they're pushing for. So... The pandemic is a hoax. Yes, the virus is real. Is it as deadly as they say? No. It's the same as the flu. And if you look at the statistics, it's the same as the flu. And you'll notice that there's very few, few, very few flu deaths this year. Yeah, because they're calling it all COVID deaths. Somebody said, well, it's because everybody's wearing a mask. Well, if your mask stops the flu virus, it should stop the COVID-19 virus. Anyway, that's my spiel for today. We're in Death Valley. We're doing basically house, or house chores, getting ready for tomorrow. 
I'll leave you with that video there, the view of the resort over there, Furnace Creek in Death Valley.